In this week's Fresco Tip Friday, I'm going to show you how to make this disgusting texture to draw with. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is make a new layer. I'm going to make like a rectangular selection like this. I'm going to fill it in with like a medium pink color. Choose pixel. Deselect that. And then I'm going to make another selection that's like the middle area of that. And choose a lighter, lighter pink. You don't have to use pink, you can use whatever color you want. Fill that in like that. And now what I'm going to do is come into the live brushes and play around with the watercolor brushes. So you see here we've got the watercolor wash soft, flat. Let's uh, do the soft one. So what I'm going to do now is paint over the edge here to just sort of smooth this line out and like blend the two colors a little bit. But you definitely don't have to be perfect. This is going to be pretty small. We're making a swatch to use. Switch over to like that darker color and then come in a little bit with that. Just sort of try to lightly mix these together. Another thing you can try doing is double tapping on your modifier and this will make it so that you're not using a pigment anymore you're just using pure water and this is a kind of a fun way to mix things together even more and you can like kind of go over the middle area to lighten that up to give it more of a, a lighter tone there and the last thing i want to do is maybe just add like a little highlight into the middle so i'm going to grab white and instead of using watercolor brush this time i'm just going to use like a regular inking brush and then just do sort of like a thin line down the middle. I'm actually gonna snap so it's straight like that and then I'm gonna come back to the watercolor brushes and then keep it on the soft wash and I'm gonna double tap so I'm just using the water. I'm just gonna introduce some water into this and just dissipate that line so that it blends in with the rest to just give us that little that little highlight. Just zoom out like that and I'm going to double tap the modifier and as you can see in the eyedropper we are getting a nice swatch that has the dark areas and the light areas and you just want to make sure you're filling that circle your highlight in the middle and we are ready to draw something so i'm going to unselect the modifier i'm going to turn off this layer i'm going to make a new layer i'm going to switch over to kyle webster's too smooth to be forgotten and let's play around with this brush and make some just disgusting letters. It's like a tentacle. Actually, it kind of looks delicious, huh? I think this effect would be perfect for making some nasty alien drawing or some weird squid type situation with like tentacles and stuff like that. These live brushes and like the multicolor swatches are crazy in Adobe Fresco. I know I've done another video on this where I showed you how to make a million different skulls everywhere or some lettering that looked like toothpaste. If you haven't tried this crazy feature, I think you should go and do it right now. If you make anything fun with this stuff, make sure you tag me on Instagram so I can check it out. If you're posting it on Instagram. I would say here, but you can't really do that because it would be a video. But if you make a video, you can tag me on that. I'll see you next Friday for another Fresco tip. But there'll also be another video on Tuesday. Not a Fresco tip, but it'll be another video. Okay, good talk. <laughs>